you are looking at beautiful Lake Michigan and we're up on the dunes overlooking the lake and it's just a beautiful day. When I look around, I see the beauty of creation. And I think it's hard to believe that the powerful God who created all of this and the heavens wants to be my friend, but you know he does. And he wants to be your friend too. I wanna to talk to you about it in your morning cup of inspiration. You say, Dan, the God of the universe, the all powerful, sovereign God wants to be my friend? Yes, he does. There are stories in the Bible, Abraham, Noah, Moses, they were all referred to as friends of God. In fact, in Exodus 33:11, I'll read to you, it says, the Lord would speak to Moses face to face as a man speaks with his friend. We can be friends with God. You know, we used to sing a song in church, what a friend we have in Jesus, all our sins and grief to bear. What a privilege to carry everything to God in prayer. And being a friend of God doesn't just happen for one hour on Sundays. He wants us to talk to him all the time, to be in constant communication with him, to pray about every decision and every activity that we face. In fact, in 1 Thessalonians 5, 16 through 18, we read, be joyful always, pray continually, give thanks in all circumstances, for this is God's will for you in Christ Jesus. How do we do that? Well, we keep him first in our mind throughout the day. Your prayers don't have to be long. You can just whisper a prayer, prayer like, God, help me with this decision. Lord, I need your direction. I need your guidance. Lord, be with my friends. Do you have friends who check up on you periodically and they stay in good touch? Those are friends you know really care about you. Well, God is always waiting to hear from us and he's always waiting to talk to us. How do we hear from God? through meditating on his word and spending time in his word. Psalm 1-2 says that the man of God, his delight is in the law of the Lord and on his law he meditates day and night. And we do that, when we do that, we'll be like a tree planted by water. Friendship with God, it's so important. He longs to be your friend and what a privilege it is to be his friend. God bless. I'll talk to you soon for another morning cup of inspiration as you just kind of enjoy the beauty of the lake.